பயணத்துல போயிட்டு இருக்கிறோம் அந்த பயணத்துல வி நீட் டு பிரஸ் ஆன் பிரஸ் ஆன் எங்க பிரஸ் ஆன் தெர் இஸ் அ டைரக்ஷன் தட் காட் ஹஸ் கிவன் ஹெவன் வேர்ட் Where Jesus is there. God the Father is there. They're waiting for us. It is a journey that we need to go. And in the journey, there is a goal that we need to achieve. And in that goal, when we achieve that goal, there is a price. Yeah? To win the price. There is a goal. There is a sense of direction. And I need to press on till I run the race to completion. Paul says, run to win. Run to win. win not for participation participation certificate kaga kadaiyadu run to win nariya per odranga ana and the winner ku dhan paris undu correct ah yeah so run that we will win there is a goal now in our companies in our offices and all that we have goals to achieve yeah all those who are in the corporate setup uh, sales targets iruko adu achieve pannano adu achieve pannana incentives kadaiko illa promotion kadaiko இன்க்ரிமெண்ட்ஸ் கிடைக்கும் ஆல் தட் ரைட் அந்த கோல் நம்ம மீட் பண்றதுக்கு என்னென்னமோலாம் செய்வோம் வருஷம் ஃபுல்லா வி வில் ஒர்க் வெரி ஹார்ட் ஃபார் இட் நைட் அண்ட் டே வி வில் ஒர்க் நைட்ல நடு ராத்திரி பிளேன் எடுத்துட்டு போனோங்க இந்த இடத்துல இங்க பிளைட் எடுத்து போனோம் இங்க கார் எடுத்து போனோம் அங்கங்க பேசணும் எல்லா எல்லா கஷ்டங்களையும் வி வில் வேர் ஏன்னா என்ன நம்மளுக்கு அந்த கோல்ல மீட் பண்ணோம் அச்சீவ் பண்ணணும் அந்த கோல் வி நீட் டு டேக் கேர் ஆஃப் இட் நவ் to press on towards the goal is a very good challenge that we have because it gives us a sense of purpose and the purpose into one irundichina we can achieve any goal right if we make up our mind to win a goal we will win it i have experienced this in my own life or a um, school la irukum bodhu na romba la i'm not a very studious person romba la first rank la vaangi andha mariya la in fact i was the opposite அப்பா வந்து பிரின்சிபல் எல்லாம் மீட் பண்ணி இல்ல வார்னிங் எல்லாம் கொடுத்து அந்த மாதிரி எல்லாம் இவ ஒரு காலம் இருந்துச்சு ஸ்கூல்ல பட் வென் ஐ கேம் டு காலேஜ் மை லாஸ்ட் ஃபார்மல் எஜுகேஷன் ஐ ஷுட் சே மை மாஸ்டர்ஸ் நான் பண்ணிட்டு இருக்கும் போது எனக்கு அப்பதான் தோணுச்சு ஆண்டவரே திஸ் இயர் இது திஸ் மைட் பி த லாஸ்ட் தட் ஐ வில் பி ஸ்டடிங் இன் அண்ட் காலேஜ் லைக் திஸ் ஆனா நான் முடிக்கும் போது ஐ வாண்ட் டு வின் அ அவார்ட் அண்ட் ஐ வாண்ட் டு make my parents proud abdinte nanu oda goal edutha okay and anga masters degree la or rolling shield or periya rolling shield irukku for those who score the highest mark in the core papers na adu mele en goal vecha and the rolling shield ah namu vaangrom nam amma appa munadi adha edukrom abdinte now when i get my mind on that goal night and day every test any seminar is there any project is there in that subject my mind was on that goal and the shield of angano so i will put all the effort needed to ensure that not even one small test i will miss and some competition irukum but at this but in the goal na vechirundanaala mathungalukku yaarkume theriyadhu in the goal but only i knew the goal that i had because i had that in my mind i was able to achieve that goal no matter what happened enna achinaala seri night thooku enak time illanaalo paravaala and the mark na vaangano abdinte oy that goal when we really put our mind to a goal to win the prize we will definitely achieve it now the action word here is press on press press na in the greek it says dioko dioka okay it's an action packed word adile or action irukku it is not a passive word adukku nama edha moyarchi pannanum it it means hasten run drive away pursue strive for abdinte in the arthangal und so it is an action packed word so what is god telling us in our journey today press on press on strive so if we strive pannanum na namalukku enna theva we need to have the right mindset our mindset has to be focused heavenly winning mindset abdinte na title potirke we need to have a mindset to win not just to participate we need to have a mindset that says i will achieve that goal and i will win the race abdin to a mindset rukano so now the bible says set your minds on things above not on earthly things so today if you have to honestly answer me ungalku success na inna unga mind la winning na inna abdin to namo vaazhkila ket na ipo ketana many of us might say it is to 
have a big position i want to become the ceo i want to have a big house or periya car nariya veed ella irukano and um, probably i want to become the you know the business partner to so and so or uh, i need to be successful in so many ways this is a success in our mind la this is the uh, way in which we will define success yeah now nothing is wrong with that when we pursue it we will get it but the bible says seek first the kingdom of god and his righteousness avara thedumode all these things will be added unto you no we are in the world but we are not of the world we are supposed to be the light in the world now those who set our minds on earthly things avanga yaar mari irukrangala they are enemies to the cross of christ abinu devanoda vaarthe solrudhu they are enemies to the cross if you set your mind on earthly things so it's very important that we set our mind on heavenly things because when you set your mind on earthly things your destiny is destruction adoda mudivu alivu but our citizenship is in heaven today the whole world loves to become you know from india at least lot of us like to become a citizenship of america to have one citizenship in a foreign country that is uh, that uh, is like a land flowing with milk and honey no milk us la citizenship kadachidana romba nalla irukum but adoda nalladhu edu a citizenship in heaven when we store up treasures in heaven moth and rust cannot come and spoil it it cannot get destroyed our citizenship is in heaven when we are focusing on things that are above then our direction towards the cross our direction towards heaven is the right direction now there are two ways for us or a narrow way and there is a broad way the bible says the narrow way is a difficult way this journey to heaven is not easy it has lot of problems lot of trials lot of testing lot of temptations nariya prachanangal undu because it is a narrow path but there is a broad way anga nariya per adula povanga nammalo ellarum anga dana poranga nam then it's okay abadi dana nam yosippo nariya per pandranga na then it should be fine illa the broad way leads to destruction the narrow way is the way that we need to choose today i want to challenge you can we press on to have the mindset that will go towards this narrow path heaven word heaven word correct right? you know in the bible we see so many examples of people who kept god number one in their life they were willing to sacrifice whatever it took so that they will honor god and show that they feared god now i want to take you through few examples the first example that i want to show you is from the life of abraham when god asked him to give up a blessing i don't know about how many uh, of us here were asked by god to give something that was very very dear to you எத்தனை பேருக்கு உங்களுக்கு பொக்கிஷமான காரியத்தை ஆண்டவர் விட்டுடு என்கிட்ட கொடுத்துருன்னு கேட்டிருக்கிறாருன்னு எனக்கு தெரியல பட் காட் ஆஸ்ட் ஏப்ரஹாம் தட் அத்தனை வருஷம் கழிச்சு ஃபைனலி ஹி ஹாஸ் அ சைல்ட் அண்ட் காட் சேஸ் சாக்ரிஃபைஸ் யுவர் சைல்ட் அப் ஃபார் மீ இல்லை திஸ் இஸ் அ பிளஸ்ஸிங் நம்ம சொல்லலாம் ஆண்டவரே இது எனக்கு ஒரு ஆசீர்வாதமா தானே கொடுத்தீங்க நான் அவ்வளோ ஜபிச்சு அவ்வளோ டைம் நான் வெயிட் பண்ணி எனக்கு கிடைச்ச ஆசீர்வாதம் ஆண்டவரே இது எதுக்கு உங்களுக்கு திருப்பி தேவை வை ஆர் யூ ஆஸ்கிங் பேக் திஸ் பிளஸ்ஸிங் தட் ஐ ப்ரேட் ஃபார் அண்ட் ஐ சாட் ஆஃப்டர் பட் காட் வில் டெஸ்ட் அஸ் God will test us this is the journey he takes us through he tests us to see how much we fear him how much we respect him how much we will honor him to what extent will we go to honor him god will test us in our faith abraham passed that test he took his child he didn't tell anything to anybody at home and abraham avana avaroda son sacrifice ah kudukkuradhukku ready aavnaar but the lord stopped him the last minute ad katti edukumode the lord stops him and says abraham you have proved it to me abraham 
that you fear me we can't to demonstrate panita god looks for people who will demonstrate the love that we have for him and the fear that we have for him god looks for such people and our tedrar for such people who will demonstrate our love for him and our fear for him and then the lord said i provide for you the sacrifice that you need to give i will provide for you abraham you pass the test i will make you a father of many nations ipdi da nam sunday school la la and paatu paadrom la father abraham had many sons but he that first son god asked him to give up god asked him to give up that blessing and he was willing to do it how many of us are willing to do this press on in your journey press on no matter what press on to even be willing to give up your blessing and when we go in this journey god teaches us about him his nature his character abraham kandavar enna solli kudutar and the journey la that he is a provider because he showed the ram there you hold the ram is here for you abraham idhane eduthuko you sacrifice this ram not your son and abraham said yes upon this mountain i will declare the lord showed me that he is my provider jehova jaira and the vartha apuda vandathu today we are able to understand that god is jehova jaira a provider because in our journey god will teach us many things and it is the knowledge of god that is important for us how do we know but the word of god says grow in grace and in the knowledge of our savior so in our journey the lord will give us more knowledge about him but for that we need to have a personal relationship with god you know i can have information about people i can have information about god but that is not enough it has to become knowledge it has to transfer into wisdom into our lives information is there i can tell i know president uh, uh, trump i know president so and so i know president so and so i know so and so people i know this politician i know that person i know the famous actors no that is only information but do i know them personally do i have the knowledge of our god now that is what god is calling us into have an intimate relationship with god and in this journey god will reveal himself to you now god revealed to abraham he is a provider has god revealed to you that he is your provider unga vaalkaila adu kaamichirkara neenga solla mudiyuma aama andavar enakkum provide pannuvaru enakku panni irukkaraaru then that is the knowledge that is the knowledge in which we need to grow okay for abraham god provided now what if god doesn't provide appo inna ahu what kind of people will we be if god doesn't give that miracle to us or god doesn't provide even then shall will we be able to worship him and say no lord no matter what happens i will worship you i will not worship anybody else lord but you abbi nammala solla mudiyuma bible la abbi oru example irukke they were willing to give up their life that is Shadrach Meshach and Abednego were willing to go and stand in the fiery furnace it was heated up seven times avangala moonu periyum thooki potavangala erandu poitaanga but Shadrach Meshach and Abednego stood in the fire and god stood with them yen theriyuma they said even if god doesn't show up they told the king king neenga panna and the vikradarthe naanga aaradhikka maatom because god will save us enga andavar engala tappu vipparu even if he doesn't i want you to note that word even if he doesn't show up so when god is silent in our lives when we are expecting a miracle or a miracle kaha namma kaathukite irukrom andavar adu seiyala namalku etha mari seiyala ana quiet ah irukkar silent ah irukkar appdi irukkom but even if he doesn't will we have the faith to go and stand in that fiery test and say no i will not give up my god i will not waver in my faith abbi namlaala solla mudiyuma god is looking for people in this journey who will say even if he doesn't show up i will still honor him he is looking for people who will love the lord with all their heart mind and soul that is the commandment of the lord ethna per inga namma vanda andavaroda commandments appu the anbu selthi andavaroda anbu appi nama demonstrate panna mudiyum i am challenging you today today let's say lord 
even if you don't lord i am going to honor you with my life with everything that i have i will give up things that i like lord because i want to honor your word and your commandments now the bible says that if you love me keep my commandments says the lord if you love me how do i show my love to him by keeping the commandments of the lord the psalmist says i will meditate on your word day and night and he says one word he will use i delight i will delight in your law lord your law is so precious to me your commandments are so precious to me lord that i delight in them the bible says think about the commandments and the laws of the lord day and night every time you get up every time you sit down andavaroda vaarthai enamo meditate panikite irukano why because it will keep us in the path that he wants us to go and the narrow path la ponuna andavaroda commandments and number follow panni aganu we need to demonstrate our love now to god by keeping his word if a man will love me he will keep my words and the vasanatha paarenga 23rd verse paarenga jesus answered and said if a man love me he will keep my words and my father will love him and he and we will come and make our abode with him he that loveth me they will be loved of my father the same verses i'm putting in tamil here for all those who are able to um, feel comfort in in the word of god in tamil if you love me keep my commandments nee ena nesikrina andavaroda pramanathai kaapathana what are his commandments iniki na ungala ketena ethra per unga veetla walls la and vasanam alla nama podrom illa how many of us put up, have put the commandments of the lord promises nariye per potrukom ethra per veetla commandments irukke ha matthew chapter 5 la full ah சொல்லிருக்கு என்ன மாதிரி நம்ம வாழ்க்கையை நடத்தணும் மேத்யூ சாப்டர் சிக்ஸ்ல போட்டிருக்கு யூட்ரானமில போட்டிருக்கு நியூ டெஸ்டமெண்ட்ல அத்தனை வேர்சஸ் அதே நம்ம என்ன மாதிரி வி ஹவ் டு கீப் த வேர்ட் ஆஃப் த லார்ட் என்ன மாதிரி ஒரு வாழ்க்கையை நடத்தணும் வாட் இஸ் வாட் ஷுட் பி ஆர் பிஹேவியர் ஆர் ஆட்டிடியூட் வாட் வி ஷுட் கிவ் அப் வாட் வி ஷுட் டூ டு என்ஷுர் தட் வி லீட் அ ஹோலி லைஃப் அப்படின்ற நிறைய வசனங்கள் இருக்கு நம்ம எத்தனை வாட்டி இதெல்லாம் நம்ம பிள்ளைங்களுக்கு சொல்லி கொடுக்குறோம் teach it day and night meditate on it day and night only then you can walk this holy path yeah inna aho nam if we keep all the commandments of the lord inna nala nadakkuma the blessings of the lord is so huge so immense the lord will bless the work of our hands everything we do he will prosper are you doubting me i will show you from Joshua's life he was a man who walked in obedience to the commandments of the lord he didn't turn from it right or left moses he was an assistant to moses joshua yeah and right from when he was young he was just hungry to learn about god through moses and he just became nobody told him become an assistant to moses abdin yarume solala but joshua had a love for the word of the lord and god and respect and revered god that he went along with moses wherever moses went and one fine day when the time came for moses his successor to take over the lord says choose joshua because he will keep my commandments and joshua so rightly id ore ore rule da moses gave to joshua keep the commandments of the lord don't turn from it to the right or to the left just keep it and you will prosper in all that you do and so surely joshua was a man who prospered in everything that he did the walls of jericho which was 6 feet in thickness came tumbling down the the river of jordan parted in two the sun stood still in joshua's period joshua says son i want the sun to stand still till i finish the battle and the sun stood still it didn't go down for 24 hours it stood still in its place what miracles happened every single battle joshua fought he won six nations 31 kings he defeated if you take a movie about him today what an amazing story that will be in everything joshua did 
he obeyed god his only goal was what obey the commandments of the lord don't turn from it don't turn from it right all life and he kept telling the people of israel the biggest achievement that joshua did was taking the people of israel to the promised land he was the one who led them there and every time he said don't turn right or left honor god obey god honor god obey god keep his commandments idena solittundare till he died the last word he gave to the people of israel was this again keep the commandments of the lord don't turn from it left or right and till the time joshua was there the people of israel obeyed the lord and they experienced blessings in their life and then after joshua left they again disobeyed god and you know the history after that what happened but when we honor god this is what god is able to do miracles after miracles successes after successes why when we honor god and keep his word and keep his commandments and revere him and honor him what god can do in our lives can be amazing amazing so i just want to leave with you these three points know him personally know him personally have faith in him unwaveringly obey him implicitly knowing him is the journey that will help us knowing him is the path that he wants us to choose when we walk heavenward and press on towards that goal god will teach us about himself personally we will get to know him more and more not information now i'm not someone no not that everybody who can by heart the bible knows god no not everyone who goes to church every sunday and does everything knows god no personal relationship with god is different from information about god so god is telling us walk with me abide in me and i will abide in you love me and i will love you my heavenly father will love you when you keep my commandments how we can keep his commandments by knowing him when we know him we will love him more and more and we'll be willing to give up everything because god loves us god loves us immensely and gave his son for us know him personally have faith in him unwaveringly no matter what happens inna nadanala seri even if god doesn't show up even if he is silent in your circumstances and situations even if a miracle doesn't happen even if you don't get double portion of your blessing can you have faith that says i will have my faith in the lord i will not bow down to any other god i will not commit adultery i will not worship any by any other idol i will not keep anybody else in my life more importance but god have faith in him unwaveringly don't go to him for blessings alone go to him because he is the author of the blessings go to him because he wants to love you and use you and honor you when you honor god he will honor you and obey him implicitly is god asking something that is so precious and dear to us obey him implicitly when you give to him like abraham gave you will see the blessings of the lord in your life when you obey the commandments of the lord you will see the blessings in your life when you walk in faith with him you will see successes in your life and then in that journey when we finish that journey today the times are bad you put there the number you blow we are closer to the return of the lord times are going to get even more tougher you think mel you are hope over we have not seen anything yet this is just the beginning idella or aarambha da idoda prachnegal nama paaka porom and that is why i want to leave this word with you adanalai da indha vaarthiya ungitta kudukkanu nirukken press on kashtangal varapodu innu mel romba kashtangal varapodu press on know him commit to knowing him personally commit to having faith in him without any doubt and obey him implicitly press on only then we will win the goal and we will win the prize and we can one day say i have fought the fight i have finished my faith i've i won the race abdina masallah now that i have already obtained all this paul says i press on to take hold of that which christ took hold of me i press on today i am telling you press on press on press on finish the race not just finishing the race but finish it well 
It is not how we started that matters. It's how we finish that matters. Finish the race well. I encourage you to finish the race, this journey that we are in. Let us run with endurance. Endurance. Because God will bring in our path tests of faith. What will happen when we go through this test of faith? It will work in us perseverance and endurance. And it will have its perfect work by making us mature and complete in him. So when we meet him face to face, God will hug us and say, well done, my good and faithful servant in Solvay. How do you say it? You are done. 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 You won the test. You kept the faith. How do you say it? How many names do you say it? How many names do you say it? How many names do you say it? Anga po mo de na katte purche ina solvar you have finished it my good and faithful servant enter into the kingdom prepared for you enter into your rest you have done it you have won the race you have won this goal i press on toward the goal to win the prize for which god has called me shall we commit ourselves to him and say lord i want to press on My journey, yevlo dooro irke ne ne ke teri la andevre. I don't know, Lord, how much of time I have remaining, but Lord, I want to press on. I want to win this race well. I want to achieve this goal, Lord. Shall we say? Shall we just close our eyes and say, Lord, I press on. No matter what happens, I'm committing today. Na ipo upukur kar andevre that I will press on. I want to have a personal relationship with you. I want to know you more. Lord, I want to have a faith in you that is unwavering. And I, Lord, I want to obey you. Every commandment that you've given, I want to obey you, Lord. I cannot do it with my strength, Lord. You know, the bella thale to mudiya dandavre, but I can do it with your strength. Holy Spirit of God, I can do it when you are help me. Will you help me, Holy Spirit? Kya klama? I request Satish to lead us in this prayer of commitment to God. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Nandri andavare. Nandri andavare. Koda kodi stotram appa. Nallavare nandri. Nallavare nandri. Vaakku maradavare nandri. Hallelujah. Vaartte kaga nandri swami. Vaartte ketum. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. All is there to press on. Hallelujah. Don't give up. Don't give up. You're on the brink of your miracle. Andavare inna andavare. August 1st andavare. Harpudam enge. I want to tell you this morning. You're one day closer to your miracle. Solunga andavare na oru naal I'm closer to my miracle by one more day Lord Hallelujah Hallelujah when we wait with that sense of expectancy Hallelujah and the expectancy order and the word that the word mo the and the and the goal reach ponnu and the expectancy order poor mo the kartha nam Lord varvar Hallelujah enna vandalam seri Hallelujah enna vandalam seri kartha nam Lord irparanga Hallelujah Hallelujah manam thalandu pova nam Hallelujah sorundu poga poga ve nam Hallelujah nam Lord varvar Hallelujah ya kadesi mudivu parindum nammalodu irpar indha ootathai mudikkira varaikkum nammalodu aandavar irparunga hallelujah kaalavel solluvoma aandavare ootathai oda belan kodunga appa kirumai kodunga appa kirumai 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 kodunga appa hallelujah thalandu pogadapadi belan kodunga appa pudhu belan lord i pray for new strength this morning lord breathe the pores of fresh oh god hallelujah oru pudhu belan kodunga raja yesuvin naamathil naan kattanidigiren appa hallelujah the belen overlookum pudu belen appa hallelujah vedam solugirathu isaiah la they that wait on the lord shall renew their strength hallelujah in the kaala velil appa amma paadupadi irkumbodhu oru pudu belen kodunga appa and ootathe oda pudu belen kodunga appa hallelujah you will run and not be weary you will walk and you will not faint and vedam solugirathu hallelujah hallelujah avar paadathil irkumbodhu avar presentil irkumbodhu hallelujah amen amen kalugu pole ninge parappirkal vedam solugirathu hallelujah Hallelujah nandri nandri pudu belan kodunga pa ala velila pa hallelujah nam kattar koppu kodupom nammude vaalkai hallelujah hallelujah inda ainda maadangalaga evlo soorugal irukalam hallelujah vedam solugirathu inda ulagathil ubathram undu belan kollungal naan ulagathai jeithen belan kollungal naan ulagathai jeithen hallelujah challenges irukum vaalkaila அஞ்சு மாசங்களில் எல்லாருக்குமே சேலஞ்ச் எனக்கும் சேலஞ்ச் ஹெலனுக்கும் சேலஞ்ச் எவ்வளவு சேலஞ்சஸ் ஆனா என்ன தெரியுமா 
ஆண்டவரே இந்த ஓட்டத்தை முடிக்கணுமே சுவாமி திரும்ப <laughs> நன்றி <laughs> அமர்ந்திருக்கிருமே <laughs> வார்த்தையில் நிற்க கிருமை தாருமே அப்பாவை மக்களுக்காக எல்லா தேவைகளை சந்திங்க காத்துக்கொண்ட தெய்வன் அதே தெய்வன் அந்த நாலாவது மனிதன் நன்றி <laughs> நன்றி <laughs> நன்றி <laughs> to do something for you lord makkaga ellarume edhaadu pannanume swami 
கடைசி காலத்திலப்பா நாட்கள் குறுகிய குறியா இருக்கிறப்பா வெரி ஷார்ட் டைம் இருக்கிற காலத்திலப்பா இசுவுக்காக உடனுமே பியூட்டிஃபுல் சாங் சேஸ் லிவ் ஃபு ஜீசஸ் தட்ஸ் வாட் மேட்டர்ஸ் அல்ல லூயா அலவேலில் லிவ் ஃபு ஜீசஸ் தட்ஸ் வாட் மேட்டர்ஸ் எல்லாரே ஆசீர்வதிங் சுவாமி எல்லா துதி கன மகிமேல மக்கே செல்பிகிரோ இயேசுவின் நல்ல நாமத்தில் கேட்கிறோம் பிரதாவே ஆமென் ஆமென் थैंक यू சதீஷ் ஆமென்